tonight. More charities across the Houston area are feeling the pinched mm -hmm. with increased demand during the pandemic, but not as many donations are coming in. That's exactly right. Channel 2 Sophia Ojeda is live near NRG Park tonight with the plea as we head into the holiday season. Sophia? Yeah, guys, Houston Charities having to make really tough decisions, looking to raise funding, but also considering cutting services and cutting positions. And I'm the only one working that's taking care of all the bills and everything, so this will help out a whole lot. I'm 82 years old, and it has helped me a lot, and my family. I have a lot of grandkids. Food giveaways like this one have been a huge help for so many families, but Houston area nonprofits continue to only see the need rise while donations continue to drop. COVID has caused us to think differently. Um, but to be unrelenting in our commitment, you know, to give. Gulf Coast Community Services Association helps hundreds of families with food, COVID relief, eviction assistance, and other services. While donations are slow, federal CARES Act money will help keep them going. Because those who needed us before COVID desperately are in dire straits now. Others like Houston Children's Charity, who has seen about a 45% increase in need, plans to move forward with their largest fundraiser of the year in April amid the pandemic, hoping to raise about $2 million. Children's needs are rising daily. We only meet those needs if we have a gala and raise the money we need to meet those needs. The majority of our money is raised at this one event. We need those numbers to fund our children's programs. Otherwise, we have to decrease our assistance. And you can help out these organizations by donating. Any amount will help, or you can help out by giving your time and volunteering. We've got more information on our website and a list of charities that you can help. Head to clicktohouston.com for more. Reporting live in Southwest Houston, Sophia Ojeda, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thanks.